Hello, dear students of second prep. Let's go to start our episode today in the first uh, or first episode in the second term as we have to study lesson one. But firstly, we should know how can we uh, mention the lessons in this uh, uh, unit. Uh, uh, we have unit one as we talk about the uh, uh, motion, uh, especially as we have the periodic motion and wave motion. Uh, so we should know, let's uh, know, motion. Firstly, what is meant by motion? As we studied before in first prep, in first term, we have motion or haraka. Motion is a change in the object's position as time passes. Yani, change in the object's position as time passes. Yani, تغيير الحركة أو تغيير الموضع, change in the object's position as time passes, or through time unit, يعني بمرور الزمن. But we have many types of motion, as we have transitional motion, as we have periodic motion. In uh, first prep, we uh, studied uh, the uh, transitional motion, الحركه الانتقاليه, يعني, uh, as we have uh, motion uh, of the train, uh, transitional motion, as the object uh, change its position as time uh, uh, time uh, passes. Uh, according to or relative to another object but in second prep we will study specially the uh, periodic motion firstly what is meant by periodic motion يعني إيه periodic motion يعني إيه حركة, uh, which means what periodic motion motion which is repeated as time passes الحركة اللي بتتكرر بمرور الزمن as we have, for example, the uh, circular motion, motion of the moon around the earth, um, motion of the earth around the uh, sun, or motion of the uh, rotary bee, this uh, motion considered as periodic motion. This motion is repeated, regularly repeated, تتكرر بانتظام, as time passes or at equal periods of time في فترات زمنية متساوية as we have for example the earth rotates around the sun every 365 and quarter days كل 365 يوم وربع يبقى here we have motion which is repeated at equal periods of time or as time passes okay Yiba motion of rotary B is considered as periodic motion because this motion is regularly repeated at equal periods of time. But we have here the oscillatory motion. Oscillatory motion, which means as vibrational motion, haraka tizazeya. What is meant by vibrational motion? يعني إيه حركة اهتزازية. Which means what? The body, the body moves or rotates around its rest point. يعني بمعنى إن الجسم بيتهز around its rest point. As the pendulum, زي ما خدنا أو we know the simple pendulum اللي هو بندول الساعة has rest points like that. This point is the rest point. If we push the pendulum, it will move on the two sides of the rest point. هيتحرك على الجنبين بتوع the rest point. So here we have the oscillatory motion أو الحركة الاهتزازية. So we have periodic motion and we have oscillatory motion. Oscillatory motion is a kind from the periodic motion. يبقى we have periodic motion as a type of motion, no من أنواع الحركة, is called the periodic motion. And this periodic motion, which means what? Motion which is repeated regularly at equal periods of time. بتتكرر باستمرار. For example, the motion of rotary B. اللي هي نحن بنحطها ونلفها كده هوت. Rotary B. This motion considered as periodic motion because this motion is regularly repeated at equal periods of time. On the other side, we have oscillatory motion. 
الاوسلاتري موشن او الحركه الاهتزازيه از ا كايند فروم بريوديك موشن يبقى وي هاف موشن وان فروم ذا تايبس اوف ذا موشن از بريوديك موشن اند وي هاف اوسلاتري موشن از ا كايند فروم بريوديك موشن يبقى نوع من انواع الحركه الدوريه اللي هي بريوديك موشن اوكي سو وي شود نو هير ذا كونسبت اوف بريوديك موشن اند ذا كونسبت اوف اوسلاتري موشن The concept of oscillatory motion, motion of the objects on the two sides of its rest point, or its original point, our origin, So we have the common example as what? As the rotary, uh, sorry, as the pendulum. We push it, so it will move on the two sides of its rest point. So, We, w- we want to calculate some uh, physical quantities related to the oscillatory motion. As what? We have number one, frequency. Frequency. Number two, we have uh, uh, frequency. And then the periodic time is the two main concepts in the oscillatory motion. What is meant by frequency? Frequency اللي هو التردد هو number of complete oscillations عدد الاهتزازات الكاملة done in one second. So we have to calculate now the frequency. عايز أحسب التردد اللي هو frequency. Frequency equal the number of oscillations عدد الاهتزازات تمام over the what the time passes but here we should know the time or the measuring unit of time is what is second we calculate time in what in second not in minute not in hour يعني in our curriculum في المنهج بتاعنا we calculate time by or using measuring unit is minute Uh, sorry, is second, not minutes. Yani if we have a time in this problem or in, in, the, in the problem in the in the exam or in quiz as time in two minutes, so we should convert from minutes to seconds. Yani times what? Times 60. Yani multiply 60, yani 120 uh, seconds. Okay. Yibba arifna and if you have a smaha. Frequency أو التردد اللي هو number of complete oscillations أو number of oscillations done in one second يعني for example تعالوا نشوفها كده مع بعض على الورقة البسيطة دي كده عندي حاجة اسمها الفريكونسي الفريكونسي as f معناها ايه؟ معناها number of oscillations done in one second okay so we have frequency so we have as the magic triangle here we have three physical quantities number one we have f frequency we have number two number of oscillations we have here t which means time but time in what in seconds okay type number of complete oscillation as for example yani five complete oscillations here the time مثلاً, through two seconds يبقى the measuring unit of time is second What is the measuring unit of frequency? Yani for example, here we have 5 over 2 equal 2.5. 2.5 what? The measuring unit at the 2.5 hertz. 2.5 hertz. The measuring unit of frequency is what is hertz. So we know now the measuring unit of time in our syllabus في المنهج عندنا is second. And the measuring unit of Uh, frequency is hertz okay 
يبقى احنا عرفنا يعني ايه فريكونسي از ا نيو كونسبت او نيو تيرم ان اور سيلبس از اللي هو ساينتفيك تيرم جديد اللي هو نمبر اوف اوسيليشنز دان ان ايه ان 1 سكند اوكي اوكي طيب يبقى وي ناو نو دير ستودنتس هاو كان وي ديل ويز بيريودك موشن يعني ايه عرفنا يعني ايه حركه بيريودك موشن موشن ويتش از ريبيتد ريجولاري بتتكرر بانتظام او ريبيتد ريجولاري ات ايكوال بيريودز اوف تايم في فترات زمنيه متساويه اند وي هاف ماني اكزامبلز اباوت ذا بيريودك موشن از موشن اوف rotary b as the motion of the moon around the earth motion of the earth around the sun motion of the simple pendulum simple pendulum is the periodic motion but if we want to mention or recognize the concept of what of the oscillatory motion oscillatory motion which means what motion on the two sides of rest point al haraka ala janbin the rest point مثلا for example wave الموجة wave like that we have rest point and this wave will move upward and downward تحرك لأعلى والأسفل يبقى هنا the motion on the two sides of rest point and we know how can we mention the frequency or we calculate the frequency frequency is the number of oscillations done in one second. Okay. طيب. We have another concept. عندنا مفهوم تاني as amplitudes. As what? Amplitudes. Amplitudes, amplitude يعني يعني we have a simple pendulum like that. Like that. This is the rest point or the origin point. The simple pendulum move to this point then it will return back again so the maximum displacement aqsa displacement hmm اللي هي اقصى بالعربي ازاحه او نعتبرها مسافه طبعا هي مش بالظبط قوي maximum displacement away from rest point is called amplitude The maximum displacement away from rest point is called amplitude. يعني for example لو جينا نشتغل هنا على ال 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 simple pendulum for example أهو نرسم simple pendulum. This is a simple pendulum. We'll move from point A to point B. like that so it covers displacement from here to from this point to this point as what as 4 centimeter so here we want to know the amplitude yani amplitude Amplitude, which means the maximum displacement away from the rest point or from the origin point. Here, this is the point, and the body moves from A to B. As we have displacement here equal four centimeter, so we have the to uh, recognize how we calculate now the amplitude. If the amplitude is the maximum. displacement away from rest point يبقى انا عرفت دلوقتي يعني ايه amplitude is the maximum displacement away from rest point اقصى مسافة أو إزاحة بالعربي away from the rest point يبقى we know now what is meant by amplitude and we know what is meant by frequency يعني إيه تردد ويعني إيه amplitude the measuring unit of frequency is what is hertz or hz 
طبعا we have kilohertz as 1000 hertz and so on but not now later we will study the measuring units of frequency so now dear students we know how can we uh, uh, deal with again هقولهم تاني motion يعني حركة motion which means what is change أو object change its position بيغير مكانه as time passes بمرور الوقت as this object in this position now after two seconds will change its position from this point to this point so we have here motion and we have many types of motions as we have transitional motion and periodic motion but in this year we will study the periodic motion periodic motion periodic motion which means motion which is repeated regularly as time passes بتتكرر بانتظام عشان كده سميتها periodic motion as motion of rotary b as motion of moon around the earth as motion of simple pendulum but we have another type of motion from the periodic motion هيقول لي periodic motion as oscillatory motion and as what as wave motion what is meant by oscillatory motion يعني ايه oscillatory motion oscillatory motion يعني حركة جسم بيتز طبعا the common oscillatory او the example او the common example of oscillatory motion is the simple pendulum why because the simple pendulum اللي هو البندول ده بتاع الساعة moves on the two sides of the rest point او the origin point اللي بيتحرك على جنبين النقطة الاصلية اللي هو كان واقف فيها طيب we have another concept as we have frequency يعني ايه frequency frequency which means what frequency يعني تردد يقول لك the frequency of this channel تردد القناة دي مثلا for example يعني 2500 hertz for example يبقى what is meant by frequency يعني ايه تردد يبقى number of oscillations done in one second So we have frequency equal number of, uh, of oscillations or number of complete oscillations over time. Time in what? In second. We, have, we know now the measuring unit of time is a second. Not minute, not hour. Time. At the same time, we have another concept. عندنا حاجة مهمة جدا. We have amplitude. طبعا frequency, the first time to know this scientific term. To study this scientific term and at the same time it's first time to study uh, amplitude. Amplitude معناها maximum displacement of the oscillatory or the oscillating object away from its rest point. يبقى maximum displacement away from the rest point of the object. أبعد نقطة عن ال A rest point بيوصل لغاية كده as for example يعني سوينج uh, المرجحة سوينج hmm? is an oscillatory motion why because the object moves on the two sides of the rest point the uh, kids تمام use the swing المرجحة move from origin point toward this point the maximum displacement here أقصى إزاحة uh, uh, أو مسافة Away from the origin position is called amplitude. For example, uh, three meters, مثلا. Then return back. So, uh, يعني كده إحنا يعني I I think يعني and I hope you know uh, the main concepts uh, in the uh, unit one, especially the first point. Uh, طبعا uh, we know what is meant by motion what is meant by periodic motion what is meant by oscillatory motion what is meant by frequency and what is meant by amplitude okay these students uh, I hope you can understand completely what are uh, we studied in this episode uh, thank you I uh, hope you can uh, join me in the next episode inshallah thank you see you and goodbye